If your car suddenly ran off the road and into one of South Florida's many lakes and canals, would you be able to get out alive? In this Local 10 Problem Solvers report, we look at a new device that could mean the difference between life and death. On a Sunday afternoon in late May, a woman drives her car down Pines Boulevard across US 27 and into a canal. Stunned drivers pull over to help, but even rescue crews can't get her out in time. One witness told Local 10 that he dove into the water and struggled to pull the woman to safety, but he couldn't release her from her seatbelt. This simple device might have made all the difference. You can see it's small enough to be used as a keychain. You pull this off, that blade right there is used to cut your seatbelt, and this right here is a center punch, powerful enough to break out a window. Henry will go down, enter the car. Dive and technology experts from the Florida Keys Community College put the device called Rescue Me to the test. They venture 30 feet down in water full of silt to a sunken car. It's an example of the worst a driver might face. Though hard to see, the driver acting as the victim is able to cut the seatbelt with a tool, then turn it around to use the spring-loaded end to punch out the window. I was able to go through two windows in one shot, which was unbelievable. It just instantly took care of two windows, side by side, one on top of the other. I haven't found anything yet that works like this. To get a better look at how it works, here's a car and driver out of water. The driver snaps the device off his keychain, slices the seatbelt, then breaks the glass. The device appeared very, very effective in cutting that seatbelt, just like that. The Rescue Me device is already standard equipment for the Florida Highway Patrol. And now law enforcement officials say every day, drivers should also have this life-saving tool at their fingertips. Remember, the difference between this and other devices is that it's small enough to be on your keychain so it's right in front of you. Now it sells through auto parts stores, home improvement stores, and catalogs, and it only costs about 25 bucks. For a link to their website, just log on to our web channel, local10.com. Local 10 News at 6 starts right now.